Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Welcome to Imagine Porch. The following is Ticks and Goldstone cartoon, followed by Tinky Winky, Whizbits, Echo Echo Ring Ring, Spanish with Clocky, Porch's Caltus Vegetables, and another Ticks and Goldstone cartoon. Stay tuned at the end of the episode for surprises with Wendy Elizabeth. Let's get on with the show. It's a hot day in Guy and River Volunteer Fire Department when a stranger came to town. Howdy, folk. Wanted Bryce the Thief for stealing the town supply of yogurt. How did he do that? I've been trying to get that stuff for, let's see, 400, 500. 600 YEARS! Jasper Jaguar? Well, you give it a break, will ya? A break? I have been playing pool table for weeks. I could really use a break, cause sometimes my hand hurts. And it's not that I hate playing pool table, but it's just that when play night and day, not the actual duration, but the actual time measurement night and day, 24-7, makes a boy really come. Just keep playing. You're doing fine. Sheesh. Hi, folk. I'm fixing a... Catching a thief. Hold your horses, stranger. Okay. Just make it quick. I'm the law around these parts, so if there's outlaws to be found, I'm... Alright. Have you seen this guy? Well, you know, on a second thought, that guy looks scary. You know you seem to be a pretty good lead on this. Why don't you be a sheriff? Ouch. I'm sorry, boss. Being a lawman is not easy. Now for the questions. What's the seventh planet to the sun? Where's Bryce? And where's he taking the yogurt? 29872 Uranus. And Bryce has taken the town's entire yogurt to blast fuel his mind control ray. And he's headed for the border in his stagecoach. What stagecoach? That stagecoach. <laughs> Bryce got the stagecoach with all of the town's supply of yogurt to fuel his mind control beam. And... We're gonna take a time out here. It's actually more of a ray. You know, it's not a beam. A beam is something else. I didn't have the budget for it. Ray. Whatever. Pretty soon, I'll use all of this yogurt to fuel my mind control ray and rule the world. 
Not so fast, Bryce. That must be him. And the wooden sheriff, Bryce, get in the stage coach. Stop it. Stop the coach. Just try and stop me, slowpoke. Go get Bryce, cowboy Pinocchio. Put your hands up in the air and see who has to get the yogurt back to the town. Stripey, I got the yogurt. Y'all have any spoons? My hero! <laughs> Be new! Oh, shucks. Well, Gassy B new got stripey. At least I got B yogurt. Oh, man, give me a break. He is the male that never fails It makes me want to wag my tail When it comes I want the whale mail Happy birthday, Tink I brought you a birthday letter Thank you, mailbox You're welcome We just got a letter we just got a letter. We just got a letter. We just got a letter. I wonder who it's from. It's a letter from Mush. He speaks in a Dutch accent. He really loves the cook. Did you mean cooking? Oh, Mush. You're speaking Dutch accent? When you're looking, here's what I have, he say. Frozen steak at asparagus. And here was a stove that you could boil vegetables. So, Jason, you better wash your hands before we cook. Okay. Got her hands washed, and now, get to cooking, Mosh. I'll get the frozen steak into a pot, and get them, get them fried. And also, try the asparagus that goes to frozen steak. Okay, steak and asparagus is just finished. Now I get to eat them. So, Dixon, how did you like the steak? You swallowed it? Can't you just talk? Speak to me. Did you eat my steak? and asparagus. Good. Because your plate of steak and asparagus just slide off of your plate and into my mouth. Get out of my kitchen. Hello, geniuses. Welcome to Quiz Bits. Let's meet today's teams. Bonnie Bear and Mr. Gramophone against Leonard Lemur and Chip. For each person who gets it right or gets it wrong, does not matter to me. Good luck. 
U, and U says uh. Every letter makes a sound. U says U, and uh. Bonnie Bear, do you know what letter it is? It's the letter U. What about you, Chip and Leonard? Guess the letter before time is running out. One Chip, say the letter. The audiences like to hear your voice. You. 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 Time's up, you two. Chip, Bonnie, you got them all tied. Except you, Leonard. Bonnie Bear gets to draw the letter U to break a tie. Better luck next time, Chip and Leonard. And I'll see you next time on Quiz Bits. Hello? Is this Echo Echo speaking? Strangers? Sorry. No strangers allowed. I'm hanging up. Hola, my name is Clocky, and this is my assistant, Quirty. Let's continue on our way with our final crayon colors. Tell me, what color crayon? Can you see it? Brown crayon. Can you say the crayon color in Spanish? Crayon maroon. Brown crayon is Quiglet's brown color of a crayon. Say brown crayon in English and Spanish. Crayon maroon. Next flashcard QWERTY! What color crayon comes next? Black crayon. Can you say it in Spanish? Crayon negro. Black crayon is Squiglet's eyes. The color of Squiglet's eyes and so as Squiglet's crayon. Say black crayon in English and Spanish. Crayon Negro. Now for the final flashcard for the final colors of Squiglet's crayons. What's the final color crayon? White crayon. Can you say it in Spanish? White Blanco. White Crayon is the color of a sky. And so is Quiglet's crayon. Say white crayon in English and Spanish. Crayon Blanco. That's all the flashcards. Thank you. Do you know what time it is? It's time for gorgeous cow chews vegetables. And now, a word for gorgeous cow chews vegetables. Greetings. This is gorgeous cow chew. I was thinking about the color orange. Can you guess these vegetables? It's shaped like a cylinder. The stem look like tree. And it's shaped like this. Starts with C. Carrot. Pumpkin. The color orange. It's time for another cartoon, starring Tixon Goldstone and his friends.
This is Joe and Jack Go Live. My name is Joe. Here's Jack. And we're going live. The streets of West Hamlin. May you see the buildings. And you'll see Tudors and Genos combined into one building. Max is getting pepperoni pizza from Genos. And the blue donkey puts air in the tire because it was flat. Phineas is tall sister Nadine the Phineas clutch toy and Phineas is being voodooed <laughs> I think I'll just lay down on the couch and sleep he's asleep I could slip up and get his antenna Are you trying to get my antenna? And I got your mask pulled off. You've been tricked. Now, I just want to get some sleep. Zoe, the handcuffed. Oh. My. Creel. I've got... In the solitary confinement. There's no way that I can escape. Maybe if I dig a hole to escape. Escaped from the cage again. Capture him. Well, those girls are gonna get me. Got to go back to Gain River to get some sleep. And now, surprises with Wendy Elizabeth. What's inside? Oh, Wendy, you got exploded by a bomb again. Sketch dork here. Don't touch that dial. Here are the following sketches for our next show. Now that was a good cartoon. Drop you down the Imagine Porch. That's it for now. The Imagine Porch Sunshine. Down, down till bedtime.